On this channel, we've talked about several different email marketing tools that you can use, and in this video, we're focusing on Brevo. First, a quick overview. Brevo's marketing platform includes email marketing, SMS campaigns, WhatsApp campaigns, landing pages, Facebook ads, and sign-up forms. They aim to simplify your email marketing efforts. You can create beautiful designs even with no graphic design experience. And Brevo claims to have a very strong deliverability rate, which means you should ideally be less likely to land in the spam folder. Sign-up forms help you grow your list day to day, landing pages help to convert visitors into customers, and the cherry on top is you get all the analytics to go with it, so you can zero in on what's working and shelve the rest for now. Where Brevo might excel most, and I mentioned this a moment ago, is its simplicity. Users are able to get up and running fairly quickly, setting up automations is pretty manageable, and the metrics are easy to navigate. This makes it an appealing alternative to, as an example, maybe something like HubSpot, which is incredibly expansive and very often more than users really need. Let's talk about the cost of Brevo and whether or not it's worth it. Now, Brevo's pricing structure is very unique in that the tool charges you based on the number of emails you send and not on how many contacts you have. There's a forever free plan where you can send up to 300 emails a day, which is a pretty decent number. And after that, you need the starter or business plans, which are $25 and $65 a month respectively. There's no daily sending limit and you can expect the business plan to give you more features. For instance, it includes everything in the starter plan, like email support, and adds on features like A-B testing, more advanced statistics, automation, send time optimization, and even phone support. There is one more plan called Brevo Plus, but you have to talk to their sales team to get a custom price. So, is it worth it? Well, it depends on what you need it to do. It is somewhat restrictive. For instance, you won't have as many opportunities to integrate Brevo with other tools like you might on something like HubSpot. And the price does jump fairly quickly. Going from $25 to $65 a month could be a hindrance to some solopreneurs and small businesses. Remember too, that the more emails you send, the more expensive it is. This all happens on a sliding scale. So it's not all that different from email marketing tools charging based on a sliding scale of how many subscribers you have. For example, if you have the starter plan and you're sending 20,000 emails a month or fewer, it's $25. But at 40,000 emails, you're looking at $35 and the price just keeps increasing. Does that make Brevo bad? No. But like we've said in the past, you do want to consider your goals and where you're trying to go. If you want to take your email marketing campaigns to the moon and grow a huge list of subs, with tools like Brevo, this could cost an arm and a leg. User reviews echo what we've already discussed. People love the simplicity of Brevo and even have good things to say about the free version, but they also say that the plans can be kind of limiting, especially when you consider the cost. People are asking for more template designs, integrations, and pricing plans more specifically. Ultimately, this makes Brevo usable for very small businesses, but if you're looking for integrations and scalability specifically, you might run into more obstacles, whether it's functionality or pricing. They have plugins for other software and platforms like WordPress, WooCommerce, Shopify, Stripe, Typeform, Wix, and several others. If you don't find what you need on that list, you're out of luck. You might also run into limited customization options with their email templates, and the email editor could be better with a few more advanced features. So what's the final verdict? Well, Brevo has a lot to offer, and it's got many loyal users, but, and I know I sound like a broken record here, if you're trying to scale, you might very well be better off with a CRM or general email marketing tool that charges based on the number of contacts you have and not on the number of emails that you're sending. Remember, if you send 20 emails to one person, Brevo only cares about the 20 emails, not the one person. Before you go, one more thing. Tools like Brevo and MailerLite are good, but there's something even better. Did you know that EngageBay is getting fantastic reviews on G2 with an overall 4.6 star rating? Users love it for being one of the best and budget-friendly all-in-one CRM tools out there. 
What's really cool is that EngageBay gives you everything you need in one place. I'm talking a CRM, email marketing, automation, and support tools. It's like having all your business essentials under one roof, making your life so much easier. And the best part, it's super easy to use and the support team is right there to help you out. So if you want an affordable all-in-one CRM solution that's a hit with users, EngageBase got you covered. It's like the best of both worlds. The CRM skills of Brevo and the email magic of MailerLite all rolled into one. Ready to check it out? Just scroll down and click the link below to sign up. You can use it for free. Thanks for hanging out with me today. If you're still here watching this video, we'd be very grateful if you could give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel and click on the notification bell and we'll see you next time.